we're here and it's happening. I am super excited about the show and I am super excited in general lately because I just got a new little dog. Yeah, she's a little chihuahua. She goes with me very well. It's a little too adorable, but I feel like I'm letting my people down. I feel like as a lesbian, shouldn't I have like two rescue pit bulls and their names are Tegan and Sarah. And I feed them like organic chicken that I grow myself humanely in the backyard and just stab in some kind of kosher way. But instead I have this tiny little chihuahua. Oh my gosh, she has so many nipples, you guys. So many nipples. Just her belly is bare, just a braille novel's worth of nipples. So many nipples. And when I first got her, I didn't know how to pet her. It felt rude. So she'd roll over and I'd just be like, is this, is this what you like? Is this love? Is this good? But then I realized that maybe the point of having so many nipples is getting your nips all rubbed. So now I get in there all the time. I read that braille novel every night. I'm just like, yes, what does it say? I'm worthy of unconditional love. Yes, I love this story. Mm, in it. Do you guys have dogs? Do you know how good that feels? It feels so good. I love my dog so much that I have abandoned my ethics. Her favorite treat is bully sticks. If you don't know, that is dried bull penis. Oh yeah. And my girlfriend and I have gone out, we've bought like every kind of dried dick imaginable. And I'm vegan, you guys. I'm vegan. I live a vegan lifestyle. That is still the least amount of times any vegan will tell you that they're vegan. I'm vegan, you guys, just so you know. If you don't know what that means, that means I've traded delicious food for self-righteousness and gas. That's what I'm doing. Hard combo to pull off as well. Just feeling superior and constantly farting. But that's what I'm doing. I'm being a little bit dishonest with you guys. I'm not fully vegan anymore because I eat fish now. So I'm vegan. Um, yeah, because I care about animals, but fuck fish, right? Get in the air like everyone else, you wet little weirdos. What are you doing down there? What are you doing? I don't trust it. But my dog's favorite treat is bully sticks. And now I feel like our house is like this conservative Republican's nightmare of what a lesbian household is like. Because on any given night, it's a little dog there just chewing on her bully stick. And me and my girlfriend are like, yeah, get it, girl! Fight the patriarchy! And then there's just jars of dried dicks behind us. Super intense. I mean, we don't need to yell fight the patriarchy, but it feels so good. It feels so right. I felt someone wanting to give a round of applause. I say, go ahead and do it. Let it spread out from you, miss. Do it, make it happen. Good job, everybody. I'm psyched. Look at your fun face in the front. This is gonna be nice. You're smiling, this is good. You're smiling too, that's good. It's, it's not as good when you don't smile. It's a little bit horrifying, in fact. Yeah, yeah, do more of this if you can.